Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Learning is Fun with Bobby. Today I am going to discuss about the beaks of the bird. Birds do not have teeth. So how do they eat? So birds use their beaks and claws to catch their food and then eat them. Now let us see how the beaks are differently shaped. Depending on what they eat, birds have different types of beaks and claws. Let us see how they are different. Now different birds have different types of beaks depending on what they eat. Let us see. Birds like woodpecker. They eat insects. Now they have strong and pointed beaks. They eat insects from where? From the tree trunk. They have strong and pointed beaks. I will try to show you. Suppose this is the bark. This is the tree trunk. And this is the bark of the tree. What the woodpecker do? They have strong and pointed beaks. And this beak acts as chisel. This beak acts as chisel and then they pull out the insects from the tree trunks and eat them. The next is birds like hoopoe. They have long slightly curved narrow beaks. Why? They pull out the insects from the holes. They pull out the insects from the holes in the ground and they eat them. So they have this long, slightly curved, see, slightly curved, just like this. Long, slightly curved and narrow beak, narrow. So how do they use, the, use their beak? In the ground there are holes and they use their beaks to pull out the insects from the holes and eat them. And the next is, Birds like hummingbirds and sunbirds. They also have long and pointed beaks. Like this only. They also have long and pointed beaks. How do they use them? They suck nectar from they suck nectar from flowers. Suppose this is a flower. And what do they do? They use their beak and suck nectar from the flowers. And that is their food. Now we will know about the fourth number of beak. The, the fourth kind of beak. Birds like eagles and vultures. What do they eat? They eat the flesh of other animals. So for that reason they have strong, sharp and hook shaped beak. Hook shaped beak. Uh, you can say a little bit like this. A hook shaped beak. So what do they do? With their beaks they tear the flesh of the other animals. The, they tear the flesh of the other animals. And the next is birds like parrot. They eat nuts type of food. Nuts. So to crack the hard nuts they have strong and curved beaks. Strong and curved like this. Strong and curved beaks. They crack the nuts with the help of this strong and curved beak. Now next we will know about two short type of beaks. Birds like sparrows and pigeons. Sparrows and pigeons have short Strong and hard beaks. Short, strong and hard beaks. For what? Because it helps to crack their food. To crack their food. And birds like swallow. What do they have? They have short, broad and sticky inside. Little bit like this. Short, broad, short, broad, see broad, not narrow, broad and sticky. 
inside portion is sticky like gum it's sticky like gum so how does these beak help it helps them to catch flying insects what do they do they fly by opening their beaks like this opening opening their beaks like this they fly the birds fly and whenever the flying objects passes through this beak what happens the insect sticks inside and the bird can eat the insect then and now the next type of beak for the water birds water birds like ducks and swans they have what do they eat they have their food in the muddy water where they live in the muddy water so they have broad flat and spoon like beaks like this broad see broad flat and spoon like beaks just like this spoon like beaks and what do they have they have holes on either side on either side of the beak they have holes and how does it work and uh, how it works birds mostly have their food from water what do they do they take in small insects and plants along with the muddy water they take in small insects and plants along with the muddy water and what happens the muddy water comes out from these holes and what remains inside the duct it remains the insects and the plants remains inside the duct's mouth and so they can have the food in my next video i will discuss about the claws and the nests of the bird thank you bye bye